For centuries, humanity has gazed up at the night sky, captivated by its vastness and brilliance. The stars have inspired wonder, fear, and curiosity, prompting questions that reach beyond the bounds of our planet. Ancient civilizations charted the heavens, creating calendars, myths, and early cosmologies. Today, modern astronomers continue that legacy, using cutting-edge instruments to probe the depths of space. Yet despite centuries of observation and the incredible leaps of technology, the universe continues to guard many of its deepest secrets. Among the most fundamental questions humanity asks is this. How did the universe begin, and how old is it really? In the 20th century, the Big Bang Theory emerged as the dominant scientific explanation for the origin of everything. According to this theory, the universe began as an infinitely dense, hot singularity roughly 13.8 billion years ago, and rapidly expanded, forming all matter, energy, stars, and galaxies that we see today. The theory has been instrumental in shaping modern cosmology, but it leaves unresolved mysteries. Questions linger about what, if anything, existed before the Big Bang, the exact mechanisms driving cosmic expansion, and most intriguingly, the recent discovery of objects that appear older than the universe itself. In 2023, NASA's James Webb Space Telescope made a shocking observation that reignited these debates. It detected a celestial object whose age, according to current measurements, seems to exceed the age of the universe. This startling revelation stunned the scientific community, prompting questions that challenge the very foundations of astrophysics. Could a star truly predate the universe itself? Is this an error in measurement, or a profound indication that our cosmological models are incomplete? At the center of this mystery lies a star located roughly 200 light-years away, in the direction of the constellation Libra. Catalogued as HD 140283, it is more famously known as the Methuselah Star, named after the biblical figure said to have lived 969 years. Like its namesake, this star is extraordinarily old. It also travels through space at an astonishing speed of 44,283 kilometers per hour, suggesting it may have originated outside the Milky Way and was captured by our galaxy during a merger event over a billion years ago. But it is the star's age that has captivated astronomers. Early estimates suggested HD 140,283 could be as much as 16 billion years old, significantly older than the accepted 13.8 billion year age of the universe. More refined measurements now place its age at approximately 14.46 billion years, with a margin of error of roughly 800 million years. Even within this range, it could predate the Big Bang itself, presenting a paradox that has left scientists both baffled and intrigued. Dating stars is no simple task. Unlike humans, stars do not show obvious signs of aging. Instead, they evolve through slow, predictable stages over billions of years. Astronomers rely on subtle clues, changes in brightness, spectral color shifts, rotation rates, and elemental composition, to estimate age. One critical technique is gyrochronology, which measures a star's rotational slowdown due to magnetic braking, akin to a spinning top gradually losing speed. By comparing rotation rates of stars with known properties, astronomers can approximate their ages. Yet, small errors in measurement or assumptions can lead to significant discrepancies, as HD 140283 demonstrates. The Methuselah star is composed almost entirely of hydrogen and helium, with very few heavier elements, a hallmark of the universe's earliest stars. Its composition confirms it belongs to the first generation of stars formed shortly after the Big Bang, yet its apparent age continues to challenge the standard cosmological model. Could it be that we have miscalculated the age of the universe itself, or are we misinterpreting the star's data? To understand this tension, it is necessary to consider how scientists determine the universe's age. 
The widely accepted 13.8 billion year figure comes primarily from observations of the cosmic microwave background, CMB, the residual radiation left over from the Big Bang. Additional support comes from measuring the redshift of distant galaxies, a phenomenon caused by the expansion of space. Yet, if these interpretations are incomplete, our timeline could be dramatically off. Recently, a team led by Professor Rindri Gupta at the University of Ottawa proposed a provocative alternative. Gupta's model suggests that the universe could be as old as 26.7 billion years. His approach revisits the nearly century-old, tired light, theory first proposed by Swiss astronomer Fritz Zwicky in 1929. The concept posits that photons lose energy as they travel vast distances, leading to redshift not solely due to expansion, but also through the energy depletion of light itself. Gupta's updated hybrid model combines this mechanism with standard cosmic expansion, providing a framework that could account for anomalies like the Methuselah star. Adding further intrigue, theoretical physicist Paul Dirk has suggested that fundamental constants, such as the strength of gravity, may not be constant over cosmic time. If true, this would imply that the laws of physics themselves evolve, challenging everything from stellar evolution to galactic formation. Estimates of the universe's age have changed before. In the 1920s, Edwin Hubble calculated the cosmos to be just 2 billion years old, conflicting with the known ages of stars. Over the decades, improved measurements have doubled this estimate, and today, with Webb, Gaia, and other advanced observatories, new anomalies are forcing us to question long-held assumptions once again. The mysteries extend beyond stellar age. Observations of the Milky Way reveal that stars in the galaxy's outer regions move slower than expected. This discrepancy suggests two possibilities. Either there is less dark matter than previously believed, or our understanding of its behavior is fundamentally flawed. Dark matter, though invisible, is thought to make up most of the universe's mass and is critical to galactic structure. Measuring the galaxy's mass requires analyzing the velocities of orbiting stars, yet even small errors in distance, motion, or distribution can drastically alter calculations. The European Space Agency's Gaia satellite has mapped nearly 2 billion stars, providing unprecedented data on the Milky Way's structure. Analysis of this dataset indicates the galaxy's mass may be around 200 billion solar masses roughly five times less than prior estimates. Whether the discrepancy arises from dark matter being less abundant than assumed, or from flaws in our models, it underscores a humbling truth. Our understanding of the cosmos is still evolving. Ancient stars, cosmic redshift, dark matter, and the universe's age all reveal gaps in our knowledge. Each discovery challenges established ideas, forcing scientists to refine theories in light of new evidence. So, is the universe truly 13.8 billion years old, or could it be over 26 billion? Is the Methuselah star genuinely older than the cosmos, or does our perception of time itself need re-evaluation? Could dark matter behave differently, or be less significant than we imagined? These questions may feel unsettling, but they embody the essence of scientific inquiry. Every answer uncovers deeper mysteries. As we continue to peer into the cosmos, equipped with the James Webb Space Telescope, Gaia, and other advanced instruments, humanity enters what could be a golden age of cosmic discovery. Each revelation brings new possibilities, challenges assumptions, and broadens our understanding of time, space, and existence itself. If you are fascinated by the evolving story of the universe and the frontiers of space science, subscribe to Discovery 2.0. Like this video, share your thoughts in the comments, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on the latest cosmic revelations. Thank you for watching, and as always, keep looking up.